Yep, I wait. Good. Yeah. Hell yeah. Beautiful. Oh yeah. Hell yeah. Boom. Yeah, baby. It's all you, big man. What we did on for shoulders, basically, what I'm trying to do right now is do my off-season workout, even though I'm getting ready for a contest. So I'm lifting all my, I'm doing my heavy lift that I normally do in off-season. So this is really off-season training being done for a pre-contest, for the contest for Mr. Olympia is five and a half weeks out but you know I'm just as strong now as I was uh, when I was uh, I was 315 uh, for what off season this year and I'm doing the same weight at 315 I'm right now I'm 285 so I'm doing the same weight that I was doing uh, at 315 at 285 but yesterday I started out with shoulders I did the seated shoulder press Start out with my light warm up as I always do. I warm up with every on all most of the, all the exercises. Start out with 135, for like 15. Then I go to 225 for like 12. Then I do uh, 275 for 12. And uh, this is all season training. I went up to 315. That's normally about as high as I go. I did 315 also for 12. And immediately following when that. I go over to what I call <clears throat> my uh, dumbbell laterals, but the only thing about my dumbbell laterals, since I only do shoulders once a week, I always incorporate like a giant set, but it really helps to build my shoulders up real good. So I start out, what I mean by giant set, I do uh, four, X's, four uh, sets back to back, and I start out with 30. I do 25 reps, then I go to 40 for uh, 15 reps, then I go to 50 for uh, 10 reps, and then I go to 60 for uh, 8 reps. And I follow that up real quickly uh, with another set, but I start off just a little bit heavier, like 10 pounds heavier on the next set. And I do the same thing, except for I start out with 40 for 25, then 50 for 15. And then uh, I did uh, 60 for 10 and 70 for 8. Uh, after that, you know, those are my two main shoulder ones. But I do also do one, like one more shoulder exercise to go with that, make it, make it three. I only do like two, <clears throat> since I'm doing a giant set, I only do like two, uh, two sets back to back, even though they're giant sets. So. My next one, I go in the, the uh, uh, it's like a shoulder raise, but I use a bar, a uh, small bar, and I did, uh, I think that was 90 pounds, 80, uh, eight, yeah, 90 pounds, yeah, it was 90 pounds for uh, 10 to 12 reps. And I did like three sets, you know, with that, and I just go, you know, <clears throat> uh, back to back with that. Uh, probably take probably about two, two, two three minutes uh, rest in between that. Thank <laughs> you. 
I need to go over to uh, some real delts. I started out on the uh, cable crossover machine, but I converted to a real delt. We got two different sets of handles, so I put in the real delt handles. And I know I'm going to start out with like 200 pounds here and do for 15 reps. And uh, then I go up to, uh, I do four sets here. I do another set, probably like 220 for 15 reps. Then I go up to my heaviest set, which the most machine I think a whole, which is like, uh, I think it's 250 uh, for like 12 reps. And I do two sets at that. So it's all together, four sets. And I followed that up immediately with another real dead exercise, bent over laterals. I kind of started, I think I started out with like 65 pounds, and I did 10 reps. I did three sets of that, and that was it. I did, uh, I think I stayed with 65 for uh, 12 reps, for 10 reps, no, I did 10 reps, uh, three sets of that. And I followed that up immediately with uh, some shrugs, working my traps uh, next. So I did a dumbbell, 200 pound dumbbell for like, I was doing basically just as much, as many reps as I could. Sometimes I get 14, sometimes I get 12, sometimes I get 13. I basically just did like uh, four sets of that. And that was just one exercise, and that was just basically it. Because after all of the stuff I had done, plus me being rushed for work, I really didn't have a whole lot of time to spend on that. Sometimes I do just one exercise, sometimes I may do two. Sometimes I may follow that up with uh, upright rows or something like that for like three exercises, uh, 135 pounds, doing uh, uh, 10 to 12 reps. But yesterday I just did one exercise. And then that pretty much uh, completes my workout for shoulders. On, on, uh, and I always do that on Wednesday. That's the only thing that I do for that one day, Wednesday, is always shoulder. Everything else alternates. Now it's time to go to work. <laughs> Real work. <laughs> Everyday thing. Last minute. Rushing this every day. Oh boy. But once I'm here, I'm here. I've been working here for 12 years now. The best thing about working this job is being able to wear shorts. <laughs> when it's 111 degrees outside and you got a vest on, that makes it about 150, 120 for you. Well, with short song, kind of evens it out to about 115. Takes it down about five degrees. 
which kind of cuts down on the sweat. Ouch. Let's go to work and do briefing. Only schedule change is uh, Steve Smith's going to take five hours vacation today. Yay. Yay. Gilchrist, that you stay with them until they get up to the top floor. Don't just leave them in the emergency room. I got a deal if they exhibit violent behavior and they're between 14 and 16. Don't go to Cooks. Take them to JPS. Cooks don't want them. A couple people put in. You can put in lettering. The streets rebuilt, uh, stone right in the nose so they can. Four, eight, seven, eight, seven, eight, 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 eight. Trying to stay clean. Yep, this house is about eating the patrol car. <laughs> Being two time Mr. Olympia, you learn how to survive. Do what you have to do. Chicken and baked potato. This is meal number three. Of chicken and baked potato. I'm not playing. I said, don't get in that van yet, you know. And I said, and so I grabbed my son by the arm. I said, you're going back inside right here. Well, she lost it and got a hold of me. You know, made a scene. What's address? Well, what's her birthday? Her birthday is 3-7. What year? 67. Oh, what, what's Circuit your job title? Oh, yes. oh well, I'm a manager. Manager. General manager. Paperwork time. Good old chicken. Masterpiece barbecue sauce. The best barbecue sauce they make. Chicken on it. County side of the lake. These showers are probably with this area, in this area, probably over the next uh, half hour or so. And 
Unfortunately, it does not look like they're going to get into Dallas and Fort Worth. But he has house with a flashlight. You can see that from the lines of her house, she's also going to be a retired officer, does have a weapon at her location on millimeter. She's about 25. Uh, she's going to see it by a teenage daughter. Knowing this, needed. The daughter's going to be a white female. It's, the plaintiff's daughter has assaulted her in the stomach area with a fist. At this time, the daughter's in the bedroom, does not have any vehicle might potentially be located. What's the problem here? Where's mom? What's going on? I'm asking her. She tried to spank me and I did what I thought I had to do to defend myself. I didn't even hit her that hard. How old are you? Fifteen. What do you mean, defend yourself? Because she was hitting me. It's your mom, right? Yeah. She hit on her foot. It's swollen. Well, she'll be lucky she just got hit on the foot. Poor shower just got hit on the foot when I was a kid. I got hit all over. She got right over her legs. If I hit my mom back, I'd be dead. Yeah, you know, I have a hard time understanding y'all kids today. When I was a kid, we just did what we were told to do. And that was just that. Why are you crying? She ain't. Oh, no, sometimes it's just... Oh, okay. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Okay, you can. Just a little big thing, I'll put the seat down on it. 00054629. It's going to be an original report, reported date 9 13 2000. Status arrested. Nature of the call is uh, assault bodily injury. Uh, I got a famous saying after every day I finish this job. Another day, another quarter. That's what it compares to when you compare it to my Olympia salary. But two-time Miss Olympia, I'm still putting in eight hours a day. And just the other day, I was watching somebody's video, and I swear, I swear I heard them say, "You can't do bodybuilding." and have a full-time job, well, I hate to be the one to dispel that, but I am an exception to that rule. I've been bodybuilding for 10 years, and I've been working here for 12. And the famous question is, why do you still work here and you're Miss Olympia, two-time Miss Olympia? My answer to that question is, because I love it. Point simple, point blank. Otherwise, I would not be here. If I didn't like this job, they could probably take it and shove it, but... Like I said, you know, I love what I do. So that's why I still come to work every day. Just like, same reason why I buy the bill. 
I think it's one of the hardest jobs out there. The hardest sports out there. One of them, you know, that's a bunch of them. That's hard. But the reason why I do all that and put my body through all that is because I love it. When you got love for something, you know what they say? There ain't really too much of nothing you really wouldn't do.